Hi everyone, I'm Tristan Tomasino. Welcome to this week's Weekly Market Pulse. Well, the clearance rate on the weekend was very strong at 78.3% compared to the previous week, which was at 71.3%, the lowest in 14 months. The most interesting thing to note though from the weekend just gone is that 38% of the auctions conducted actually weren't reported. Their results weren't reported to the REIV. So it's more than likely those properties passed in or are still in the midst of negotiations and those agents didn't want to report those results. So we probably expect that the clearance rate was more so around 74 to 75% on the week and still up, well up on the previous week. Now what we are seeing at the moment is due to the clearance rate dropping significantly and property prices not holding as much as they were earlier in the years, there are a lot of senior economists coming out and starting to predict what the market will do in particular for the next 12 months and more so in 2018. And Terry and Todd have just released a great report that states that the Melbourne market in terms of houses is approaching the peak of the market. It is yet to peak compared to units, which have actually peaked and are starting to climb phase. Now why they believe that the unit market has peaked is firstly, there is a lot more supply compared to demand at the moment. With the investors no longer investing in off the plan developments with stamp duty savings gone out the window for them, thanks to the state government. However, what we are seeing is that houses still have some room for growth, especially in 2018. A lot of people believe it could go up as much as 5%. Not as much as we have seen year on year for the last two to three years of maybe 10 to 15% in some areas, but a good strong growth of 5% over the next 12 months. So what does that mean to all our viewers out there? Well, if you are looking to sell, it's great news as the next 12 months still look like they'll have great results. If you are looking to buy, you may need to up your limit a bit over the next 12 months. As always, look forward to seeing you on next week's Weekly Market Pulse and have a great week.